Okay, Big Daddy, take the hat off. All right, turn to your right. I said turn, Pip! <laughs> I'm looking for a crested blazer. A crested blazer. I wore one once and I really think it did something for me. The Joseph Abud crested blazer is the finest. That's hand ticking. Hmm, and they'll match my sneakers. <laughs> Shall I wrap it up? You know, I'm not sure. What? I'll come back later with someone see what they think. Uh-huh. What's the uh -huh for? Yeah, I'll be back. Yeah. Uh. And then he makes a face like he doesn't believe me. Oh, so he knew you were making it up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he caught. Exactly, so don't get mad. Why do you want to go back there if you don't want the coat? Because she thinks I was lying. I want to show him I was. <laughs> I gotta prove myself. This friend of Susan's is staying with us for two weeks. Now, am I wrong or is that excessive? Yes. Excessive. Oh, Sacramento, he stayed with me once for a year and a half. He's a wig master. He's a wig master? He's with the touring company of Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat. He gonna offer George a wig. <laughs> Later. I said I'd come back with someone and I did. Surprised? No, I believed you. Yeah. You did not. Hello. I'm Craig. Hi. <laughs> Jesus, there she goes with the smile. I work for Jay Peterman. I love Jay Peterman. Oh. I especially enjoy the catalog. Those fans. Look at Jerry's face, like, here we go. Oh, really? Well, you know what? I write. What do you think of that first? <laughs> Back to the subject at hand. I'll need you to write down your phone number on the check for me. Perhaps you could do the same. <laughs> <laughs> Look at how happy she is. Uh. What about that guy asking you out right in front of me? What is the big. Deal. Very emasculating. He doesn't know the nature of our relationship. Right? <laughs> Look at Jerry. How dare he? How dare he? And Elaine smiles about. Ugh. <laughs> Wig guy. Hey, sweetie, how's your day? I already asked him that. He said good. <laughs> Thank God you're home. I walked out. Walked out. This dude. Look, can you take me over? Take the bus. I'm not gonna take the bus. That's why I got a car. <laughs> <laughs> that does make sense. <laughs> oh God, don't call George. He's already stressed. Hello. Listen, can you take me over to Jiffy Park? Yeah, I'll pick it right now. Bruh. All right. Oh, he wants to get out of there. <laughs> One extremely annoying shift later. Would you pack a station? <laughs> Now the volume knob fell off. Stop touching shit, Kramer. Oh, God. What? It's a oh! How did a condom get in the car? I can get you a um, considerable discount. Really? Mm. Well, actually, yeah, I did see this amazing little black dress. The Nicole Miller. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll take care of it. But I barely know you. Well, we'll um, just have to do something about that. <laughs> the face! Last laugh of the way? Yes, lovely. You know, I'm just curious, how did you know she wasn't my girlfriend? Because you know, we used to go out. Oh, you did? Oh yeah, we went way out in a while. Oh, Jerry! Oh, look at homegirl on the back that George had an issue with. For your wife? Huh? I didn't know she's not my wife. <laughs> Meanwhile. You walk in this city, you gotta expect things are gonna stick to your foot. You open your car and ping, condom. That doesn't explain the lipstick on the dashboard. Here, take a few shirts. I don't want no rusty, musty shirts. You can get your car now. The keys seem to have been misplaced. Wait a minute, I need those keys. You like Cadillacs? Take that pink Cadillac El Dorado over there. It's a Mary Kay car. <laughs> Kramer doesn't care. He's like, that'll do. Something funny going on here. Much later. Have you slept with him yet? I just met him this morning. It's been known to happen. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of girl do you think I am? This guy's gonna dangle that dress in front of you. Uh. Behold, the Technicolor Dreamcoat. 
no, you ain't wearing that. You'll probably wear it too. Ugh. I, I uh, was wondering if you and your uh, friends are doing business here with the Jiffy Park. Yeah, anyway, see, the thing is, I, I, I found a condom in my car. Now, I'm not saying it's yours. I just I want to know if I should change parking lots. I'll pay you for your time. I, I just I just need some information. How much do you want? Uh, 10? 15? Uh, <laughs> and she said, you ain't, I'll take that. Later that same evening. Of course I'm telling the truth. Because I have to be able to trust you. There's no way that this can work. Really? George, you want out? We have to deal with the doubt, Susan. The doubt must be doubt. I have no doubt, George. Do you? Mm-hmm. No. <laughs> Much, much later. I can't wait to get that dress. <laughs> yeah, it should arrive imminently. <laughs> but you said it was in the store. No, 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 we, we sold out. We've had to order some more. Ian! Hey, Craig! Elaine, this is uh, Ian. Oh, hi, Ian. Ian. Sir, tell me, how you doing? Well, I'm working over at the Andover shop, actually. You should come by. I'll get you a great discount. Maybe I will. Nice meeting you. Oh, nice to meet you. Bye. <laughs> Cheerio. He's just the discount guy. Uh, you know that clothing salesman had a lot of nerve hitting on a lane right in front of me. Cherry is really in his feels about this. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take that jacket back. I'm putting this guy right out of commission. <laughs> a petty ass. I'm gonna turn in. I can't go to sleep at nine o'clock. Well, you can go to your room and read. Hold up. <laughs> Look, you know, you're the one who's locked out. Right? Oh, why don't you go sleep at Newman's? Oh, he's got a girl up there. He does? <laughs> Check out Newman. <laughs> and then you got your shoes on my shit. Oh, I would kick him out. Well, can I sleep with you? Hell no. Kramer, there's no way you're sleeping with him. Why? Why? Yeah. Do I really have to explain? What's that? Squire's walking stick. I had to write about it for the catalog. Oh. You want it? Yeah. You can have it. I don't need it anymore. Uh -huh. <laughs> Look okay. at Cherry. Yeah, I am. You are wrong about Craig. He told a man he'd give him a discount too. Don't you see? <laughs> it's all a big scam. <laughs> you're nuts. Well, perhaps he thinks that you're working him. Mm -hmm. Shaking that little butt of yours. <laughs> a little but and now if you would excuse us we need to get to bed <laughs> jerry's like yeah oh, he let him you said you were tired take your ass to sleep this patio furniture's on sale <laughs> Much, much, much later. I think I made a big mistake. I, I'd like my deposit back, please. What's the problem? You got hookers turning tricks in my car. How's that for stars? Yeah, that is all you're saying. <laughs> all right, very good. I'd like my car and my deposit back, please. Can't do it. Ugh. All right, just give me my car and let me get the hell out of here. That's going to be a problem. <laughs> Why? It's all the way in the back. We can't get it out for a couple of days. <laughs> what? Better with you. This is a parking lot! People are supposed to be able to get their cars! Ideally. I want to kill this guy and it's not even my car! I don't think you can return an item for spite. What do you mean? Well, if there was some problem with the garment, if it were unsatisfactory in some way, then we could do it for you. Let me speak with the manager. Excuse me. He wants to return this out of spite. We can't return an item based purely on spite. Well, so fine, then. Then I don't want it. Well, you already said spite, so... <laughs> Too late! A lot of boring math later. Yeah, she's the costume designer. What is Kramer wearing? <laughs> Mr. Cool Man with the shades. You have really beautiful hair. Oh, thanks. I love her hair. Have you ever thought about selling it? It would make a brilliant wig. Ethan? Yes? Hey, it's me, Jesse. How are you? Good. Good to see you. This is Jerry. Hello. Yeah. Um, maybe you and I should um get together. Have you been on the slide at Club USA? It's Jerry's gonna get upset because he's he could have been with him. Right in front of me? How do you know 
know we're not together. <laughs> I don't know. I just didn't. Well, it's very emasculating. <laughs> Twice. So, um, so do you have any idea when the Nicole Millers are coming in? Well, the, well, the funniest thing. Huh. I, I've learned that the new shipment's coming by boat, which does tend to take a bit longer. Oh. So, um... This dude, with his excuses. No. Hi, this is Bob from the Andover shop. I'm trying to reach Craig Stewart. Oh, um, is it important? Well... Hey, let me ask you something. Do you know when the Nicole Millers are coming in from Milan? We aren't expecting any Nicole Millers. In fact, we have too many as it is. <laughs> Just tell him he doesn't have to be in tomorrow until 11. She knows. They make wigs out of human hair? And pay plenty for them. Mm. <laughs> Elaine! Elaine! Uh. Oh, sweet Maria. Hey, it's gone. Who is in the car? This half a. Hey, 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 where are you going? Hey, you just cost me some. Hold it, lady. You look like a pimp. <laughs> Fighting with you. Police officer, freeze right there. Yeah, it doesn't look good. <laughs> okay, Big Daddy, take the hat off. All right, turn to your right. I said turn, Pip! 